In the heart of Borneo lies a vast rainforest adorned with lush emerald hues. Beneath these towering canopies, streams of crystal clear water weave their way through the dense foliage. It is here that we encounter the resilient people who call these forests home. They have forged a symbiotic relationship with nature, relying on its abundant resources for sustenance and survival. Their lives are intertwined with the rivers that flow through their lands, and they honor the profound interconnectedness between land and water. These rivers provide sustenance and transport, weaving communities together in a web of connectivity. As these streams gather strength, their currents unite, forming mighty rivers that etch their paths through the landscape. These rivers reach their journey's end as their waters spill forth, merging with the saline embrace of the ocean. It is here that we meet the South China Sea. This is the largest state of Malaysia. This is Sarawak. In the vast expanse of the South China Sea, an extraordinary expedition is about to unfold. The teams from Petronas and the Department of Fisheries Sarawak have come together with a common purpose. Recently, they again venture forth into the depth of the ocean. Witness the beginning of an extraordinary journey where science, conservation and adventure converge. Mysteries await and the underwater world holds its breath in anticipation of the secrets that will be unveiled. Miri is a coastal city located in the northeastern part of Sarawak. It is the second largest city in Sarawak. In this vibrant city, modernity seamlessly blends with its rich cultural heritage. All that we do in Petronas comes back to our statement of purpose, which is to enrich lives for a sustainable future. And that really inspires us to launch the Rix to Reef program, proactively managing assets and of life responsibly and safely. Today, the team from Petronas and the Department of Fisheries Sarawak are embarking on an expedition to assess the progress of two rigs to reefs, Baram 8 and Dana. With the arrival of Tuan Bohari Haji Leng, Senior Director of the Department of Fisheries Sarawak, the team feels the significance of this mission. Jabatan Perikanan Laut Sarawak telah bekerjasama dengan pihak Petronas bagi menjayakan program melabuhkan pelantar-pelantar minyak yang telah dijahtauliahkan dijadikan sebagai tukun tiruan. The expedition begins its voyage to the first artificial reef site, Baram 8. The open waters beckon, promising both adventure and challenges that lie ahead. During the journey, the divers exchange ideas and strategies, while Inchik Casto, the ship's captain, skillfully guides the fleet towards the designated site. Submerged in 2004, Barham 8 was later gazetted as part of the Miri Sibuti Coral Reef National Park in 2007. The team finally arrives at the dive site, ready to explore. With decades of combined experience and expertise, these divers are well versed in the challenges that lie ahead. Each one brings a unique set of skills, from marine biology, environmental science, to underwater photography, providing a diverse range of perspectives. The moment has arrived. The divers plunge into the depths, disappearing beneath the waves. The divers catch their first glimpse of the reef. They are greeted by a breathtaking sight. Towering before them, the colossal rig commands their attention. Its sheer size leaving them in awe. 
A bustling community has taken hold, transforming the structure into a metropolis of the sea. Vivid colored fish roam freely, weaving through a kaleidoscope of corals that have flourished like a bouquet of flowers. The reef teems with an explosion of color, A multitude of fish species dart playfully through the reef's labyrinth, while an immense grouper maintains its regal stance. As the divers venture deeper, they encounter more wonders. Yellow sea lilies and colorful feather stars add splashes of beauty. It is evident that life has thrived in Baramate over the years, as the ecosystem has continued to flourish and evolve. Yet Baramate's significance extends beyond its vibrant inhabitants. Its structure not only functions as a conservation tool, but also serves as a barrier for trawlers, offering refuge to the fragile ecosystems thriving beneath. Its dual role underscores its significance, highlighting that its purpose extends beyond conservation alone. With their mission accomplished, the divers emerge. Their faces are brimming with joy and fulfillment. Back at the ship, they eagerly share their findings with the rest of the team on board. Their excitement is contagious as they describe the abundance of marine life and the thriving condition of the site. Spesies sekarang yang kami temui adalah spesies uh, Tubasteria species atau dikenali sebagai uh, sun coral yang mana spesies ini kami belum pernah temui uh, sebelum ini. Kehadiran spesies sekarang ini menunjukkan kawasan ini telah matang. The divers now venture towards their next destination. Located 10 nautical miles from Miri City lies Dana. Reefed in 2017, it is relatively younger than Baram 8. The journey is fraught with a tinge of anxiety and anticipation as the projected weather conditions indicate the presence of strong currents, which brings forth new challenges. This dive will demand more skill, experience and courage. The depth is 47 meters below sea level, far greater than Baram 8. As the divers approach the site, a solitary structure stands proudly amidst the vastness of the ocean. Thousands of fish dance effortlessly around this massive edifice, creating a mesmerizing display of life and movement. Shrouded in darkness, the environment adds an air of mystery to this underwater realm. The tranquil scene comes alive with the swift movements of hundreds of shimmering fish. The divers venture further, keen to uncover more. Concealed within the rig's recesses, a colossal grouper, a skittish pufferfish, and a blue-striped grouper find sanctuary from would-be predators. Delving deeper, the divers unlock a secret world concealed within the vibrant corals. Sea slugs and Caribbean shrimps quietly go about their lives, hidden within this thriving ecosystem. A world of miniature marvels comes into focus. Soft corals of every shape and size provide shelter for an array of tiny sea creatures, nurturing a delicate balance within this newfound haven. Dana, a hidden gem in the ocean's embrace, stands as a testament to the profound impact humans can have in nurturing and preserving our fragile marine ecosystems. The astonishing biodiversity witnessed during this dive attests to its triumph. Emerging from the depths, the divers carry their findings back to the surface, brimming with excitement. They share their encounters at the reef, each expressing their appreciation for the ocean and the positive impact that the Rigs to Reef program has had. The once barren ocean floor has now become a thriving marine ecosystem with an abundance of fish, coral and other sea creatures, demonstrating the success of the reefing project. The positive results from the reefing was celebrated by all stakeholders from the perspective of marine habitat restoration or biodiversity enhancement. Both lead to a sustainable marine ecosystem. It's been one week. Chikanis meets with the team from Petronas at Miri Fish Market to assess the local fish stock. As she engages in conversations with the fish traders, an array of additional benefits emerges, shedding light on the impact of conservation initiatives such as Rigs to Reef. 
Jabatan Perikanan amat mengharap agar pihak Pertuanas dapat mempertingkatkan lagi program kerjasama seperti ini pada masa-masa yang akan datang dan membentuk usaha sama yang lebih erat dalam bidang pendidikan bersama Institut Pendidikan Perikanan Sarawak. The abundance of fish around these artificial reefs has revitalized fishing grounds, providing fishermen with a consistent and sustainable source of income. The increased fish stocks have not only improved their livelihoods, but have also brought economic stability to the entire fishing community. What was once simple lives for fishermen in Miri has now blossomed into a vibrant community that thrives on the coexistence of nature and human prosperity. In cementing our commitment to Rigs to Reef, Petronas is actively discussing with the Department of Fisheries to finalise the 10-year Malaysia Master Reefing Plan. This master reefing plan will specify the structures and suitable locations for the reefing of these facilities. The idea is to create multiple reefing villages throughout the country, contributing not only towards sustainable facilities decommissioning, but also to the national food security and ecotourism activities. Through the success of Baramate and Dana Rigs to Reef, we witness a powerful example of marine conservation in action. These initiatives showcase how human innovation can foster sustainability and create thriving ecosystems where once there was barrenness. As we continue our efforts, let us be inspired by these triumphs and strive to protect and restore our precious marine habitats for generations to come.